maybe like a three or four credit course or you know class and i'm just like i don't care <laughs> i'm fearless ready to fall ready to love you i ain't scared Good morning. It is Friday, about almost 10:30. Um, I have to go to my posse event today called Posse Deloitte Impact Day, and I have to go to Posse tomorrow at Audubon Park. And we have to bring like certain things, so I'm going to Win Dixie right now to get 10 bananas because that was what I was assigned before I go um, into the city. So I'm gonna go do that. I am back in the car, got bananas, they're not 10, they're like, there's eight and then there's six, so I probably got like 14 bananas, which is fine. I'm just gonna drop that off, so I'm about to head on my way down to the city to get there, like I have 30 minutes to get there. I like writing, but I don't like being told when to write, like, happy best friend's day. Happy best friend's day. Happy best friend's day. I'm not arguing with nobody about my life. Justin, if you ever goes to Hawaii, Justin, 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 Justin,
we have to have an advisory board council and another lady's coming in to talk about their New York trip. I won't be going to New York. I wish I was. But, yeah, so I have to be down to get in the van and everything now. So I'm going to get off, get out the hotel, and just go on about the day. All right, see you guys later. Outfit of the day. Say good morning, you guys. Good morning. Uh oh. Uh oh. Delicia want to be on camera. No, I don't. <laughs> she turned around for it. Alrighty, well, I just finished my meeting at LSU. I'm going home now. I'm trying to get home a certain kind of different way so I can miss all the construction and traffic that's going on. So, this light is horrendous. Hopefully, we're going now, but we'll see. So, I'm driving right now. I'm get off. Um, I'm going home. It was a great meeting. I adjourned the meeting. So I'm, I'm the chairman of the board, and it just went really well. I'm going to miss it. Um, I hope to come back as like an adult leader or something later on in life when I'm kind of old but yeah so it was good so I'll make it back on the road I want to update you that I am going home
months. So I have literally been uh, fixing the schedule for the millionth time for college right now. I'm going to tell you more about what today was really about. But right now I'm trying to map out how long of a distance it's going to be for me to walk to one class to another while this little schedule. I've literally changed it for the third time since I'm in the car. Mom isn't in the car so she can hear me talking to my phone, of course, because she'll think I'm crazy. However, what happened today was um, I went to my school, Tulane, and from there on, I was learning about the different resources on campus, learning about um, the different outlets that we can go, um, career readiness uh, and success, especially for internships, getting started with that, knowing what you know undergraduates are and where we can turn for the undergraduate um, process there learned about different activities and of course most importantly we scheduled our classes uh, it was very fun i'll put in some little clips here and there so you can see it's just really me walking around um i was too busy conversing with the students that'll be going to school with me and everything um and i guess from what i've been videoing i guess from there it's going to be like a whole week a day a, a week in the life of me so that's kind of how it's going to be set up i want this channel to really be about my growth as an individual growth as a college student onto a career professional and everything and i'll do a video more about me and who i am and you know things like that so i can get my platform on it because it's really for me just for my family um, who really don't get to see me all the time and everything and can really divvy into my life and the things that I'm interested in so I think that's going to be pretty cool very excited to get started my YouTube channel and I'm very excited to you know take people along with this journey with me because I think it's just amazing to see how people grow and for me to like maybe five ten years from now look back on what I've done and what I've videoed and what I've captured I think it's going to be very special for me and you know probably even my kids who knows so yeah so I think that's really just it um all this literature college is college just graduated from high school I think that was very special all right See you later. Alrighty, hello. But just giving you an update on what I'm doing and what I'm really stressing about right now. Not stressing. So I'm going to try to plan my next semester with my credit hours and everything. You just try to get that underway, I'm guessing. It's so hard. Because, like, you want to take six classes, but, like, then you may go over it because it may be, like, a three or four credit course or you know, class, and I'm just like, I don't care, <laughs> but I should care, because I don't want to overwhelm myself right now. They gave us this really neat uh, academic planning book, kind of how to get through the first year of planning. It's pretty interesting, especially for those who are going to go into like pre-law, pre-med, and everything like that. It explains that really well. It explains um, the course requirements really for your certain individual colleges that they have in the undergraduate umbrella. And what you need to do really around first semester to kind of meet those goals. And I've kind of checked off what I've met since I'm trying to double major. And so it's a whole lot going on. TIDES is a acronym for Tulane Interdisciplinary Experience Seminar. Um, it's a freshman year course. It's really courses that really divvy into everything. I think it's really just there to get us really a culturally enriched, enriched experience in a small knit group of people that um we may need um freshman year so i think it's a really good idea that they put that in mine is the us versus dim tides i'm in the kaleidoscope rlc um kaleidoscope rlc is really for those who um, are looking uh, more around equality whether it's with race gender sexuality those type of topics um more about inclusion and everything so it's very easy to do rlc very easy i recommend it if you are looking into two lanes so i'm trying to get these classes set so i don't have to really stress about this when it's like time to re-register, like I'll have like a set mind straight. Now my mind may change when the year goes on, but at least like that's the one thing with me. At least I have a set plan, and if I follow through with it, I follow through with it. And if I don't, then I don't. It's completely okay. So yeah, um, I think since today's Friday, I guess I'm gonna end the vlog here. Tomorrow's not really anything. I hope your fathers have happy Father's Days on Sundays. Uh, if I have anything else to add, I'll just add at the end of this. But officially, me, I am ending this. Yeah. Uh, so it was a really good day i enjoyed it you'll see the videos you'll see the pictures you know so roll away 22 bye you guys